Hey to the love of TV spitting at y'all. I just actually did this blog, prediction blog, but I had to erase it and do it all over because uh, my TV was in the background and it was just too loud. So when I went back and watched, I had to just do it over. So Canelo Plant, I mean Canelo Plant, Canelo Alvarez versus Caleb Plant. Um, first off, I want to start off by saying I used to be a big Canelo fan. I used to fuck with Canelo. Tough. But Canelo, you know, been having been looking shaky on the performance and had some drugs area, you know. He been dropping dirty, failing drug tests. He always avoiding black fighters. Um he won't he ain't been fighting the best competition. He been he been franchise building, dropping bills, moving to other, like just doing a lot of little suspect shit. So with that being said, I'm riding with Caleb Plant tonight. I wouldn't I'm looking for the upset. Because if Caleb Plant win, it would be considered an upset. I'm looking for the upset tonight. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm, I'm riding with Caleb. Um, am I? Do I think Caleb can do it? I'm not sure on that. If I was a betting man, if I was betting money, I'd roll with Canelo if I had to bet. But since I'm rooting for Plant, it's why I'm not going. If I was betting, I would be. I would go with Canelo. But since I'm rooting for Plant, I just can't bet on this fight because I'm on Plant to pull it off. I'm looking for the. I wouldn't mind the upset coming through. We don't really care. Yeah, yeah, I do. I want Plant to win. I'm lying. I want, I want Plant to get him. I want Plant to get the fight. But I don't really see Plant getting this win because if Plant don't stop him, he's not going to get the win. Everyone knows that if it's a close fight with Canelo, or even if you clearly win, you're not going to get a decision. Example, uh, Triple G clearly won that first fight against Canelo. That caught it the draw. The second fight can go either way. You know what I'm saying? And I still, that fight can go either way, but they gave it to Canelo. You see what I'm saying? If anything, the second fight against Triple G was a draw. And the first fight was definitely a win for Triple G. But the second one, you could have called the draw, and they gave it to Canelo. Uh, the, the fight with Lara, I felt like Lara got that fight. You know, people try to say, oh, he was running, he was running. No, 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 no. People forget the, the, um, the whole point of boxing is to hit without being hit. And Canelo did not beat Lara in that fight. If anything, they could have called that a draw if they was going to just try to take the fight from Lara and give it to Canelo. You know what I'm saying? Canelo always had close fights. And you ever, and, and, and do you notice he only got one loss, which is, to, which is to a black fighter, Floyd Money Mayweather, who was also probably arguably the best of all time, skill-wise. You know what I'm saying? He didn't beat Lara. That's why he avoids all these black fighters. He avoided all these black fighters. That's why he is not going to – look, he not fighting Demetrius Andre. He not going to fight him. If you don't know who that is, if you're a casual, go look up Demetrius Andre. Canelo has been avoiding him. He ain't fought the Charlos. He ain't fought. He ain't, he ain't gonna fight Andre. I don't think he gonna fight Benavidez or none of these dudes who got a chance of really beating him. I don't really see him really just jumping in there, you know, due to the politics and you know it's just, it's a lot of bull. It's a lot of shit that going behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying? And he ain't fighting the top, the top competition in my opinion. So with that being said. I would mind um, Caleb beating him tonight and shaking things up. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Fanon. What Fanon said, I wouldn't mind Caleb Plant really shaking things up. Fanon said he don't really care what, uh, who really wins it. I won't. I ain't gonna lie. I don't want Caleb to win because I'm sick of. I'm, I want Caleb to win because I'm sick of Canelo on this shit, man. He ain't. You know what I'm saying? And I used to be the biggest Canelo fan until he got on that bullshit. So, um, like I said, if I was a betting man, I'd be betting on Canelo. Um, but Caleb, Ed, he does have a chance in this fight. He really does. He has a chance in this fight because he's good on his feet. And uh, he's good with the movement. He's slick. Canelo has problems with slick fighters that's good on their feet. And right now, since Canelo is team no black fighters, Caleb Plant about the closest thing you're going to get to a black fighter for Canelo to be fighting. So that's what I got, man. So really... I won't plant the win, but I think Canelo probably gonna get it more than likely because the plant don't stop him. He not gonna get the win, and I don't see Plant stopping Canelo. And then one thing um, I'm worried about for Plant too. Plant seem to get very fatigued in the later rounds. You know, when I watch the Caleb Plant fight, he gets fatigued in the later rounds. And if he get fatigued, how I done seen him do in other fights, and Canelo on Canelo gonna take advantage of that shit. He gonna put the pressure on that boy for sure, <laughs> for sure. And the boy Canelo can crack. That boy can crack, so he better be on his shit. Cause Caleb Plant get hit, he get he gets hit a lot, 
And nigga, you can't afford to get hit by Saul at all. You know, you just can't. Saul is that nigga. Like, I, you can't take that from him. Saul, that nigga. You know, performance, hands, and drugs or not, or whatever. He that nigga when it, he, he good with his hands. So, we shall see, man. Hater the Lover TV, man. Like, like the video. I really appreciate it. And um, trying to build this channel up, man. Sorry if I seem a little. It's just one of them days. You know, um, quiet house. Kids gone. I don't hear no noise. You know what I'm saying? The lady gone. It's just me and this motherfucker. Me and the dogs and the cats. Just one of them days. So I'm about to get ready to head down to um, my cousin Mad Hatter house. And get ready to watch the fight with him. He right down the street from me. So about to go down there and get it in with that bum. If you watching bum, I'm on my way bum. And um, that's pretty much it, man. Had a love of TV, man. Like I said, like and share. I really appreciate it. Trying to build this channel. If anybody dog lovers out there that might see this video, you might want to buy a puppy. I will be uploading the puppies tomorrow. They almost four weeks old. So I'm finna start putting videos of them up and promoting them, letting y'all see. It's two boys, two girls. So it's only one girl available and two boys available because I'm keeping a girl. She had five puppies, but the runt ended up getting sick. She held on for about three weeks. I tried everything, took her to the animal hospital. I was actually gonna upload all that too, but since she ended up passing, ain't no point. I tried to save her, came out a lot of money. It was a waste because she didn't make it. So um, we got two boys available and one girl. So I will be uploading that, uploading that too. Anybody that might feel like they want, might want to buy a puppy. Puppies will have papers and everything, so just hit me up. Other than that, hater love of TV, man. We sign up out of here. Fight time. Let's go.